What's up, everybody? I'm Evil Rabbit, and we are staring at a very snowy RTR Mustang of Chelsea Denofa. It's the winter season here in Forza Horizon 4, and we're back because we did do the races and challenges to get that RTR uh, BC Racing Dirt of Tires Mustang of Chelsea Denofa. We're going to be ripping that thing today in the city just to see how it feels and, uh, well, give it a chance and see if we can get back into Forza Horizon 4 and on Forza 7 a lot. So definitely going to be something to uh get used to for sure but before we get into that there is something that i'm super excited about so forza has updated um the hud setting in horizon and i found out this out in my uh, live stream for my endurance race they now have data out in horizon 4 so you all you have to do is basically turn on data out have the sim dashboard app Enter your IP address from the uh, device that you're using and your port number, the port number you put in whatever you want to use. And then um, you're good to go to have a dash right behind the wheel or like I do right behind my wheel or off to the side. So we're going to input our uh, IP address, get our tablet running, and then we're going to go rip this RTR around the streets and, uh, well, have a little fun with it. So we do have our dashboard set up. If you see, we just have a simple gauge um, uh, for speed and gear. And a shift light for this RTR. And that's really all I wanted. So we're going to just, uh, well, we're going to go full send on this and see if we can't get used to drifting here in Horizon 4 again. Because, uh, like I said, I've been on 47 a lot. So Horizon 4 drifting might be a little bit weird. And, uh, oh, what better way to try it than in an RTR? Oh, yeah. It's definitely different. The feedback is... So different compared to uh, motorsports, but we're gonna try and make it work. I don't want to wreck this car that you know into another car yet, because we just uh, just got it. This is pretty much the first drive I've been doing with it, car. Oh, first drive I've been doing with it. Apparently, we need to go in third here, and the snow is definitely not helping. I know there's no snow on the ground right now, but. Just have on that light post. They don't need that light post. Kind of getting the feels back. It's kind of not as, uh, I would say, powerful as it feels in motorsport. But then again, we're probably going a lot faster in motorsport. Because I feel like I can't drift in fourth gear here in Horizon 4. As much as I could in motorsport. We're trying to kick this down the street. A little clutch kick and forth. Yeah, it almost like it's definitely uh, the speed is not as fast here on the streets with this car. And the e-brake seems to work a lot better in Forza Horizon 4 than it did in Motorsport. Well, we're definitely. Uh, just uh, trying to get back the feel of this because Horizon 4 Motorsports two totally different games and I can drift here in Horizon 4 you guys have seen it on the channel before so this is definitely just trying to get back used to the feedback of the wheel here in this game there we go we kind of got Got it a little bit. A little left foot break, but it is cool to have my cluster again here in Horizon 4. So definitely going to be doing some more Forza Horizon 4 stuff for sure because we do have our digital dash. And uh, it's kind of the coolest thing for me to see when I'm racing these cars or drifting these cars and stuff like that. I love having it in motorsport for all my drift cars and race cars, but... Uh, that was not the right turn to do. So I don't think I'm doing... Uh, apparently my brakes are constantly on. That could be doing what uh, is messing with me. And then I need to adjust my uh, braking advanced settings right now. Deceleration dead zone. Set that to uh, 
97 because the way I have my uh, brake set up. Oh, oh, oh. Well, before you guys all blast me in the chat, in the, in the comments, I feel dumb. I was adjusting the wrong uh, pressure setting. I was adjusting the outer one, which is for Matt, you know, how far the pedal has to go down, not the start of the pedal throw. So now that we got that adjusted, maybe we'll uh, have some better drifting. Maybe that was my problem all along because the car was giving some brakes when it shouldn't have been and it was kind of maybe messing with my drifts. I'm gonna go with that other than the fact that you know been used to uh, motorsport feedback and stuff, but we're gonna go with that was the problem. Oh, the stop. Because, uh, well, we are doing a little bit better now. Now that we got the brakes sorted out. So I think that was my problem the entire beginning of this video because my brakes were on and giving me some issues. Because now we are ripping this RTR of Chelsea Denofa on the streets here in Edinburgh. Oh, excuse me. Let's kick it that way. So definitely excited to have one of the RTRs. I did miss out on Von Gittin's RTR. I was unable to complete that. So hopefully it will be available again because otherwise I will feel really sad. What's up, man? A little honk honk there. Don't know. Didn't see your gamer tag. You're going to be following me, aren't you? Who you at? Who are you? Oh. <laughs> As I pull a rewind. Wrong button. I changed my buttons around. He's probably super confused now. So we got four of them, but we're not going to worry about that. We're just uh, worried about having a little fun with this Mustang. And just ripping the streets here in Horizon 4 into Nova's Mustang. Now that we got our brakes sorted out. Trying to see if I could do that trickery, but uh, this Mustang is definitely not an easy car to handle. If you guys have this car yourself, let me know how you, uh, how you guys are doing with it because uh, I'm uh, definitely not used to uh, the feedback right now and uh, I feel like, oh God, I feel like I'm kind of just uh, having issues with controlling this car. But hey, you know, go from Forza 7 to Forza Horizon on a wheel. It's definitely a, uh, a big different feel. That just means we're gonna have to come back to Horizon and do more drifting here on Horizon to get back the feels of it. But the FD cars always felt weird to me here in Horizon 4, but uh, this is what we are doing here for today. Ooh, got it. I should have held that. Rest in peace to me, always wanting to pull handbrake. So I think we're gonna fast travel and hop over to back to the festival area and uh well rip the little mountain section that is here on the mainlands. Because I don't think we're gonna hop over to um Fortune Island for right today. Maybe for another episode if you guys want to see more with the RTR, let me know down in the comment section down below. We are gonna go uh have a sip of our corona because it's been sitting over there. And do a little more drifting in this RTR before the end of this episode. If you guys want to keep seeing Horizon 4 on the channel, let me know. And, uh, well, there's going to be a lot more racing on the channel as well. If you guys didn't tune in for the 12-hour uh, Sebring race with my buddies, um, that was a lot of fun. Had a lot of fun streaming it. So I think we're going to be doing more of that here on the channel. More streams, more live 
endurance races, maybe some solo endurance races, not as long, because some of the IMSA races are an hour and 40 minutes, two hours, three hour races. I feel like I can stent those myself. So, we're going to rip this a little bit more, see if we can't get it a feel for it a little more here today, but definitely going to be having to hop back more in Forza Horizon 4 to get the full feels back on the wheel. And we don't want to go that way. We want to go this way. So, uh... It didn't take me too long to get this car. It did take a little bit of time. Not gonna lie, some of the races were, uh, quite taxing, especially that, uh, age to perfection race with other, with other people. I was kind of like over the wheel too much there. And it snapped a lot. It's a Nova Mustang. I'm gonna have to do a tune on this. So if you guys have a good tune for this Mustang, let me know down in the comments what your uh, gamer tag is. Definitely be very curious to try some other people's tunes and see how other people are fairing in this car. Especially if you have a wheel tune. I'd be very curious to try some other people's wheel tunes because uh, this thing is just so spongy and uh, I feel like I should dial this a little bit better and I feel I would enjoy this car a lot, but I do like my other cars rather than the FD cars here on Horizon 4. Oh, we're gonna hit the wall. Ow, we three-wheeled it, but in the wrong type of three-wheel. So until next time, guys, make sure you guys follow me on Instagram and Twitter, all of which are found in the description box below. This is all snowy. This is gonna be interesting. And as always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. <laughs> oh, ow. I want to know, is it, the, is it the Mustang or is it me? It feels a little bit nicer on the snow, which is very weird. It could just be me. They need that wall. I'm just using all the power on this car right now, just flooring it, pretty much. Not the best car for the snow, but... We are... Oh man, why did you go? We are here doing our best. Oh my! I am not the smoothest in this car right now, just a tap. So now I'm curious. As I almost break my wrist, my wheel, I'm curious. Grab one of my cars that I know and love. See if it's maybe just me, or if it's the way the car is handling and I'm just not used to it. Let's bust out the Evo. See if maybe it's just the car and I need to figure out how to handle an RTR Mustang. I think it's just a Mustang. Apparently I need to figure out how to drive the RTR again because my Evo does feel much more solid, does not have as much steering angle as that Mustang does, but I'm a little bit more comfortable in drift with this car. Oh, maybe it's just me. Of that. So maybe I just need to tune that RTR to make it handle better for me. That is just off the win. Did not change it at all. I feel like I need to make some uh, tuning to that car to make it handle better for me. And get back here on Horizon 4 more. You have arrived at your destination. So if you guys want to see more Forza, Forza Horizon 4, I can't speak today either, let me know down in the comments as well as uh, if you guys want to get into some online sessions. I'd be very interested to get back into some online sessions because I apparently need to uh, get back into drifting here in this game for sure. I 
There we go. That's a little better. That's a tree. <laughs> That's gonna do it here for today. I'm Evil Rabbit. I'm out.